This is Joanne Musa, the Tax Lien Lady, and I'd like to help you to avoid the competition at tax sales. I know this is probably one of your biggest challenges as a newbie tax lien investor. How to avoid all the competition at the tax sale. When you hear about how fierce the competition is at the tax sale, you're likely to give up and throw in the towel on tax lien investing before you even get started. So I want to share with you three ways to avoid the competition and get double digit returns on your tax liens. The first strategy that I use for getting tax lien certificates at interest rates of 15% or higher is to target properties that the institutional buyers don't want. This cuts down on a lot of the competition. One way that you can do this is to go to out of the way more rural areas and bid on smaller liens. Do not discount tax liens on vacant lots. But before bidding on them, make sure that they are good buildable lots on paved roads with utility access. I also like small utility liens. Typically these liens are from $200 to $600. In New Jersey and in many other tax lien states, unpaid utilities such as sewer, water, or garbage pickup charges can be sold in a tax sale. You are issued a tax sale certificate for these liens and they are treated the same as a tax lien. Because these liens are typically small, the institutional buyers usually do not bid on them. You can get these liens at much better rates than the larger liens that everybody wants. These two strategies work well for live tax sales. But what about the online tax sales where the interest rate is quite frequently bid down to single digits? I will let you in on my secret for bidding at these tax sales. Don't do it yourself. Invest in a tax lien investing fund or use a tax lien investing agent to do the bidding for you. You at least want to do this in states that allow you to have sub-accounts when bidding. Sub-accounts are extra bidder numbers that you are allowed to get in some state. But you have to have a tax ID number for each sub-account. So that gives the institutional buyers a huge advantage. When there is more than one bidder at the lowest bid, the winner is chosen randomly. The more bidder numbers you have bidding on that lien, the more chances you have to be the winning bidder. Tax lien investing funds and tax lien investing agents can use the tax ID number of all of their members or all of their clients. So they can have many sub accounts or bidder numbers and thus a large number of bids. Find out more about bidding strategies and answers to other questions about tax lien investing in the comprehensive tax lien investing home study course Build Your Profitable Tax Lien Portfolio. Just go to www.profitabletaxleanportfolio.com.